everybody, welcome. If you're new here, my name is Jessie. Today I have a very brand new box to show you. It's called Aroma Reveal. And this is the very first box that they've done. It's a November box. I saw it advertised and really, really was interested in the variety. Uh, I reached out to the company and asked if they had one that I could potentially review and show all of you and they agreed. So I'm very thankful for them that they sent me this uh, box for free for my complete uh, review. Uh, so we're going to get started in a minute. I just want to tell you um, Aroma Reveal is a mixture of aromatherapy, skincare, and beauty products. And they say it's kind of like a pampered spa at home experience. So I'm looking forward to seeing what's inside and I hope you are too. And if so, please stick with me. So I just want to show everyone how gorgeous this box is. Uh, the artwork is truly amazing and I really love it. I'm usually not a fan of pink, but this light pink stuff is, uh, maybe it's the rose quartz crystals that I like, but it's starting to appeal to me quite a little a bit. All right, I think there's a theme and a saying that they bring up a lot, unveil your serenity. So I'm looking forward to that. And it looks like it's packaged really well, so I can't wait to get in here and see what's inside. All right, everybody, look at all these goodies. This is truly an amazing, amazing box. I'm so excited. Here's the first item, this card. It says, no matter where you are in life, if you are let kindness be your guide, you'll always find your way. Got a gorgeous picture of a sunset. And turning it to the back, it's a postcard, so that's really sweet. You could actually uh, send it to someone if you want or keep it because the artwork is beautiful. There's also a card that explains the mission of the box, but I've pretty much gone over that, so I just want to jump right in. Uh, looking on top, I see these uh, Lemongrass Aromatherapy Premium Incense Sticks. That's really cool. I've actually never used incense, um, so I'm excited to see what these smell like. Uh, it's hard to tell with the box, there's so many smells coming from this box, I, I am um, not sure. But this, I'm assuming, there is no, I, at least at this point in the box, I do not see a product guide, but I'm guessing this is the incense burner. Uh, it looks to be about the shape of the stick. Um, so this is really pretty, I love this piece of wood. This is just gorgeous. Um, so I'm going to take a look at these incense sticks real quick. All right, the incense sticks are packaged fairly well, so uh, I'm not going to open them right now because I'm sure it preserves their freshness, uh, but that's really exciting, and I look forward to using those. All right, next we have, all right, next we have this pumpkin spice tea. It comes in a really cute little bag, and oh, there's actually two. There's an apple cider tea. I'm a big apple cider fan. I think I will definitely be trying that one. And wow, these look really good. The um, company is Eastern Shore Tea Company. Teas flavored with imagination. Very nice. So the teas just reminded me, Eastern Shore Tea Company. This company is actually based in Maryland, my home state. So this is the first box I've gotten to open um, from my home state, and I'm very excited about that. Uh, we have a great eastern shore with tons of beaches. But anyway, I, I digress. So next it looks like there's this um, little package here. I'm seeing an essential oil ball. Uh, sorry, essential oil bottle and it looks maybe like a bath bomb. Let's get inside here, see what that is. All right, so this is definitely what I've been smelling. It's the rose. Um, I'm assuming it's a bath bomb. And it smells... Actually smells very sweet and soapy, yeah, but I, I, I kind of I like the smell. It's not overpowering. Um, it's a good, looks like a good size too. So this would make a really nice gift or you could use it in your own bath. Um, obviously whatever you want. And in that nice package came a bottle of peppermint essential oil. And the company is L Laguna Moon 100% pure essential oil. Tiny print is very tiny, but there it is. I'm going to open it up and see what I think. All right, the peppermint oil smells great. It's definitely uh, pure peppermint. It's, it's like all the other peppermint oils I've smelled. So I'm really excited about that. 
and I can't believe I'm trying to balance a round item on here, but we'll see how it goes and you can all laugh along with me. Uh, so next we have this body butter. It's a spa by Bon Vital. It's number one preferred brand by of massage therapists. It's cocoa and shea butters for deep moisturizing. Paraben and sulfate free. This is awesome. Let's definitely let's see if we uh, might have a safety seal, but I'm going to see if I can open it. And it looks like it's, um yes. Ooh, lavender and rosemary, two of my favorite oils. How exciting. All right, so I opened up the body butter. I'm, I'm horrible at opening things. I put a little bit on my hand to maybe see the sheen. Um, it's very soft. It absorbs very fast. I will say the smell is fairly strong. It, um, I, I definitely smell the lavender. Honestly, don't smell the rosemary too much, but, but that's okay. Um, it's, it's really, uh, it's a sweet scent. It smells nice. It's very similar to the, the bath bomb, actually. Maybe the, those two were products were just next to each other, and the smells are combining. Um, but yeah, it, it's, it's, it's creamy. It feels good on my hand. I would really need to keep up my hands being soft now that I'm doing all these unboxings. So this is exciting. Um, definitely... It's a good size product too. I like that and it's got a good texture. All right, so the next item was packaged very well in bubble wrap. It's a wax warmer. Uh, it looks like it's a plug-in one. They, it came with instructions and cautions of how to use it. It says uh, live, love, laugh. And it looks like you put the wax melts up here. Uh, this is really cool. I've seen a bunch of uh, wax melters and warmers and they all seem to be a little bit different this is the first one i've seen that plugs into the wall um so this is pretty cool and let's check out i like the color it's kind of like an olive green in case you can't tell so surprise next we have these lavender dream soy wax melts which is awesome when you get a wax melter it's awesome to get wax melts with them and this is the Moonstone Candle Company, established in 2018 from Connecticut. And typical wax melts. I'm not going to open these. I already have some open, but these, uh, I'm sure, they smell like lavender pretty much like everything in this box. It's kind of just emanating out at me right now. Okay, can I just say, can anyone believe the amount of products right now? This is truly amazing. Um, I've never seen this many products in such a great price box before. Um, but here's some Epsom salts aromatherapy uh, with lavender scented uh, by Face Values. I have used uh, lavender scented bath salts before, uh, even just in a, as a foot soap. They're really nice and calming. I, I love bath salts. Um, just very relaxing. Very excited to get these. I'm going to clear this off a little bit and we'll continue. I really love how they have aromatherapy products and they actually include information about essential oils. The essential oil quick reference. I gave it a quick once over and there's literally a whole bunch of ailments in here and different oils that you can use for each thing to, to perhaps uh, reduce some of your symptoms. I mean, the list goes on. It's just basically a bunch of charts, and it's probably really reflective for you guys, but let's, I'll just uh, get some random examples. Uh, let's see. Chap skin, Roman chamomile, pedigrain, myrrh, sandalwood. Wow. They've, I mean, this is, this is incredible. This is an incredible list of um, oils and uses. Chronic pain, soothing blend, wintergreen, helichrysum, peppermint, copaiba. Yeah, I can definitely vouch for copaiba and pain. So this is an awesome reference guide. Really like this. I can't wait to delve into that more. Uh, next we have this exfoliating foot mask. Wow. All right. I've never, well, I've never tried any type of mask before, but if I were to try one, it might actually be a foot mask. Um, hey, cool. Wearable sock type foot mask. I've, that's, that's where, I love that it's wearable. Okay, so it says it's exfoliating. Peel away hard skin and calluses, repair and soften crack heels, moisturize, nourish, and renew your skin, natural ingredients, and plant extracts. And it's also a lavender scent. I'm assuming uh, each box might have a different scent. Uh, I'm assuming this seems, <laughs> we seem to have a lavender theme here, which is great for me. I know lavender is kind of a love or hate scent, but this is really exciting. Um, it shows the instructions on the back. Very cool. 
And next we have this Dead Sea Salt face mask. Vitamin C, Dead Sea Salt, and coconut oil. It's, the company is Spa Therapy and it has activated charcoal in it as well. And I didn't, I didn't say the company on the uh, foot mask, but it's uh, Oliver. So there you go. Wow, you guys, this box keeps on giving and giving. Here is a uh, chapstick, Pure by Nature, Nature Stick, Vanilla Luxury. Ooh, that sounds like that smells really good. I love the vanilla scent. Anything on my lips that's vanilla is just pure heaven. Ingredients, beeswax, sunflower seed oil, coconut oil, castor seed oil, lanolin flavor, shea butter, and cocoa butter. Very nice. I, I'm not going to open this right now. I have a bunch of lip, uh, chapsticks lip balms open, but I can't wait to try it. I love vanilla. And look at this gorgeous, gorgeous packaging. This looks like something out of, I don't know, a great stocking stuffer. Very, very pretty. Black currant and olive butter, shea butter spa soap. Wow. This is, this is like luxury. This is definitely pampering in a box. The smell sound, smells amazing. Um, I, I don't want to open it because I'm not going to use it right away, but I'm definitely going to try it. Uh, this is by the Greenwich Bay Trading Company from Raleigh, North Carolina. Just, I, I, I just, I'm just in awe with the packaging right now. Very, very nice. All right, this box is jam-packed. I'm so excited. Look at this gorgeous green color. I'm thinking a scarf, but let's take it out and we'll verify for sure. I'm so excited. Okay, everyone, this is the most beautiful, soft, amazing scarf I have ever seen. Maybe I'm just in love with this deep color green, but look look at the design. There's there's tassels at the end. I really wish I could show you the full size. Uh, it's basically just a big uh, square sheet, so you could fold it in many ways, really any way I think that you want. Um, if you guys have any tips on how to wear scarves for fashion, I've always just worn them for uh, warmth. I mean, this is definitely, this is very soft and warm all in itself. Uh, you totally wear this outside. Um, I, oh my, this is so soft, you guys. It's so pretty. I am very excited here. I'm going to try to find the brand name for you. All right, so unfortunately, I'm going to butcher this name. I think it's Pash, Pashmina. I think that's an M, I think. It was also in the packaging, but very hard to read, but it says it's Maybe this is a, I should look this up. This, I think it's a 70% pashmina, 30% silk. That's what they're saying the material is. If you guys know what pashmi, pashmima is, please look at, uh, let me know in the comments. I'll also look it up after this. And if I find out anything, I will pin it below or put it in the description box. But wow, I'm just, I, I can't stop obsessing with this scarf. I never even used to be a scarf person until I had to work jobs in the city and park far away from my workplace and had to wear, you know, business attire with, you know, thin little office pants and sub-zero temperatures. And it was in that moment I realized scarves were very, very important. Um, this is the, the back, too. It's just, I mean, look, at I just, I can't get over this pattern. So pretty. Deep green is about my second favorite color. I'm just, I'm, I'm in love. And I'll stop obsessing. Let's go to the very last item. Um, basically, I know this box says something, you get a surprise item at the end that says unveil your serenity and it's supposed to be like an extra item. And it looks like I have a Kate Spade New York wallet. I'm going to take it out of the packaging so you guys can see it better. Wow, that's sparkly. Yeah, sorry to blind it anybody. So yeah, this is a Kate Spade wallet, you guys, and I've never owned anything Kate Spade in my life or anything this, this sparkly in my life. I'm really excited. It looks like there's, there's one, two, there's three slots for cards. 
and that's a really nice item to put in this box. So I, I'm going to attempt to give you a brief recap. I don't know how I'm going to even try to show you everything, but I really want to because all these items are truly amazing. All right, so this is the best I could do. Um, truly, truly amazing box. Let me know what you guys think in the comments. I'd love to know I mean, what was your favorite item. Um, what do you what do you think? I mean, this is I think this is the most products I've seen. The price is outstanding. Even if you aren't a fan of everything in this box, like let's say you don't have a bathtub, you don't like baths, maybe you don't like the certain scent of something, these items are so luxury that luxurious that they're just they're giftable as well. Um, and everything is just super amazing. I, I really. <laughs> I'm in all. This might be one of my all-time favorite boxes, just in terms of value, for sure, value and amount of items. Uh, well, the way it was packaged, everything is just simply, simply amazing. They overdid themselves, and they even make this very nice little card at the end. Thank you for your order. Have a nice day. And they say to reach out if you have any problems with your box. So thank you so much. Aroma Reveal for sending me this for review. Uh, in case you couldn't tell, I had a fantastic time reviewing this. I cannot wait to use these products. And I, I know that a lot of my subscribers and fans are probably going to love a lot of these items as well. Uh, so I will definitely link the Aroma Reveal website down below. Thank you guys so much for tuning in with me today. And again, I uh, really appreciate your comments. Let me know what you think about everything. I mean, this is just I'm still like in a wow mo mode right here. Um, so take it all in and breathe in deep. I wish, I wish we had smell-o-vision, you guys. It smells really nice in here. Uh, but thanks for tuning in and catch you next time. Bye.